A six count federal indictment charges a longtime Blair educator with sharing child pornography. Thanks for joining us. I'm Bill Shamert. Investigators allege Daniel Hutzel used a form of the word teacher in an online forum to exchange lewd photos of children. KETV Newswatch 7 investigator Joey Safchek is live with details just going public today in this 10 month investigation. Bill, we were in court this afternoon, although our cameras were not allowed. Hutzel came into the federal courtroom in a jumpsuit and handcuffs, but he'll leave jail tonight. The judge ordered his pretrial release on the condition he doesn't interact with kids other than supervised visits with his own. Hundreds know Daniel Hutzel as an educator, a longtime fixture of the Blair Community School District. He was Zoe Neff's choir teacher for four years. Nobody really suspected anything like this. Friday, Hutzel was before a judge inside the federal courthouse in Omaha, facing six counts for possession and distribution of child pornography. Will it be his intent to plead not guilty and to request Rule 16 discovery? Yes, Your Honor. Audio from the court hearing and a 17-page arrest warrant lay out the case against him. I find that the conditions recommended by pretrial services do mitigate the court's concerns with regard to both flight and safety. I think it's mostly just a ton of anger um, and sadness. On September 13th, 2021, a company that runs real-time chat websites made a report to the National Center for Missing and Exploited Children. The tip was about 19 files uploaded by someone using the screen name G Teacher. Investigators later linked that username to Hutzel's IP address at his home in Blair. Nebraska State Patrol investigators described two of the uploads. One involved a girl between the ages of 8 and 10. The other, a boy between ages 10 and 12, posed with an older girl. In both images, the children were captured in lewd positions and partially or completely naked. In November, authorities executed a search warrant on Hutzel's home. When asked if he remembered seeing the image of the young girl, Hutzel, quote, advised that he thought the girl appeared to be of age. According to the search warrant, Hutzel told investigators there were somewhere around 100 to 800 pornographic images on his laptop. It was definitely surprising and confusing. Former students still in shock as U.S. attorneys prepare prosecution. And in court today, the judge ordered the installation of electronic monitoring devices first thing Monday morning. The maximum penalty for each count of child pornography is 20 years in prison. Bill. Joey, thank you. The superintendent of Blair Community Schools sending a letter to families in the district today. Randall Gibson notes Hutzel is no longer an employee of Blair Schools, and the district does not believe any Blair student was involved in Hutzel's alleged criminal activities. The superintendent tells parents that Blair Community Schools is a safe space for anyone to report any concerning information they may hear or see.